Hey what's up you guys, I'm Hasana. I'm Uswa, we're Hasana and you're watching our YouTube channel. And today we are doing another inspired by where we take someone whose fashion inspires us off of Instagram and we recreate six of their outfits that are based off of their Instagram. And today we have Aziza aka Wolfie Aziza yes, off sir. of Instagram. And her style is really street style based. Mm -hmm. Period. She will wear now. One thing about Ziza, she will wear a New York Yankee cap, which I can respect. That's right. Because at the end of the day, New York gonna be New York. Period. Um, she wears a lot of cropped blazers, parachute pants, which I love. I love a good parachute pant. Um, uh, Adidas sambas. Let's come on. You can't go wrong with Adidas sambas. Or Nike Air Force. Now she owns Adidas Sambas. I gotta do what I gotta do in this life. Um, yeah, so like baggy pants. She wears a lot of ties. She's, you know, we have a lot of things in common. And Ziza, honestly, cool. one thing that we picked up while going through her Instagram is that we own a lot of similar things. Yeah, a lot of pieces. So like, we just said we have to do Aziza. That was it. Um, she does a lot of crew necks, like the knitwear crew necks, mm -hmm. and then puts another shirt under that. Uh, blazers, like I said before. She's sometimes a layering, you already know. Sometimes she'll wear a little skirt. Sometimes <laughs> she'll wear a little dress, like a little white dress, like I like the one I want for you, cause we're twins. So, um, we're gonna recreate six different outfits of hers. We hope you guys Check enjoy it. Let's go. Okay, so for my first outfit, Aziza has on like these green parachute cargo pants, really wide leg pants, a white button up. You already know. A uh, black tie, as she should. A uh, pink purse. And then a staple, staple Yankee cap. Yankee with no brim. Yankee, Yankee, Yankee all day. That's it. And I'm not sure what shoes she has on, but I'm guessing because we're both Samba Adidas girls. She has on Sambas or either Air Force Ones, but I decided to go with the Samba. Um, And this is a really chill fit. Like, when I was over in the house, mom was just like, oh, you look cool. And I was like, you already know. Oh, and she also has on a black humor, but I believe she just has it back. And then it looks like she just has it hanging, but I'm not sure. So I did the best I could. And you know, this is just, it's really nice. It's really chill. It's like casual, but it's still elevated. Like you're going to get compliments on this fit. Thank you with no breath. That's it. Ooh, bars. <laughs> So for this outfit, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. I feel like this is my favorite. I could be wrong as I go through the little, my little other outfits, but I don't know. I'm really feeling this one. Um, she has a classic tie. Nice class, <laughs> a nice classic tie. Has a Prada in the middle. I don't have a Prada. So I stuck it with a little heart pendant that I sewed for my sister. Um, and the bottom of these are actually Dickies. Ding. So yeah, classic suit and tie, white button up. Um, she did have some loafers. I found another picture and She has her scarf and like a nice little classic bun I'm rocking those she had studs. I put little pearls in there and she had a little pink a little pink purse I was feeling this one Okay, so hands down, this is my favorite outfit. I know I'm saying that for all of them, but this one, it gotta be it. Just, just look, the all black is, is fire. The layering, come on. So Aziza has on black loafers, black uh, pants, a little black dress, black tie, black uh, vest, and then her jacket is like mint green, but I didn't have a mint green crop jacket, so I went for black. And I put my Kimar as the mint green, because, you know, I had to take inspiration from the original and then I wore a black purse and but I believe hers is pink so I just want to switch it up and then she has on these uh I think hers are silver silver sunglasses and some hoops yeah she killed it with the layering like come on the the, the pants the skirt over I mean not the skirt the dress over pants and then the vest over the dress 
and then the vest over the dress, and then over the vest is the jacket. Come on, she killed that joint. I would have never put this together. I usually I don't do all black, but this I look like I'm about to um I'm about to have a meeting with the prime minister or something. I don't know the president, somebody, or I'm a secret agent. You ever seen that TikTok where the girl goes, <laughs> uh, "Do you have the target?" Yes, sir. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put it right here. Do you have eyes on the target? Yes, sir. The person on the right. He is my son. You are to protect him at all cost. He's my only son. Hello? But, um, yeah, this is, this is a great fit. This is awesome. At least I knew what she was doing when she put this fit on. Interrupt this program to bring you a special report. Is there anybody out there who still isn't clear about what subscribing to Hasa does to your brain? Okay, last time. This is your brain. This is subscribing to Hasa. This is your brain when you subscribe to Hasa. Any questions? So this outfit is definitely giving Hasa is going to the farmer's market. Farmer's market! And she getting the vegetables she needs. Because eat your vegetables. If you didn't already. And um, in this outfit, she's wearing Air Forces, which I have. She has these light khaki to white parachute pants, which I don't have. So I do do a little Tommy Hilfiger slack. Uh, why does everyone have this shirt? <laughs> I have two of these shirts. My sister has three of these shirts. My mom has two of these shirts. Was I feel like we all had a meeting. It was just like, this year, we're all going to own this shirt. I was very glad when she had this shirt on. Because everyone has this shirt. <laughs> Comment down below if you have this shirt. I want to know how many people have this shirt, shirt, shirt. Anyway, she has like a khaki tote with it, these big glasses, and a white key mark, and like a little bun, and little gold hoops. So that's what I did. Okay, so this is my last outfit for Aziza. I think I killed this joint. We three for three, boy. Um, she has like a white prairie cottage core dress type beat type vibe. And she you knows she has, you know, she has her sambalamas on. So, you know, I had to wear my sambalamas. Scrunched up white socks. And her dress has uh, sleeves on it. Mine doesn't. So, I had to compromise and put on my puff sleeve uh, shirt under this and then you know she got on the white keemer buzz lady with a keemer and um a white yankee cap i might need to go over to her house and maybe borrow some of these white yankee caps you got not white the different colors because she got all the colors i'm missing out um so i just opted out for my green one and this outfit is bought you know anything with sambas a little dress a little hat we got it going on. I like the way she put this together. Um, it's great. Okay, so for this outfit, I'm 100% feeling like I went to like 2094, it's giving 3000s, like I have to fight somebody, I was in uh, iRobot with Will Smith, it's giving iRobot, <laughs> it's giving iRobot, um, she has, I don't know what shoes she had on, but she did have like some black slacks, she had a leather shirt, but I didn't have one, so this is 100% a jacket, <laughs> and I put the tie over the jacket, you gotta do what you gotta do, you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, again, she had like the Prada tie. I put the little heart pendant because I don't have one. Um, she had these silver sunglasses, a scarf, and a nice little simple bun. Ready to go. Ready to go. And I just paired it with these uh, big old loafers. I feel like the guy from, is it, it's not Looney Tunes, the, sh the, the game. It was like a game with, it was like a bot, these bosses that you would have to fight every time like you walk past Toontown. them. Toontown. Toontown. I feel like a boss from Toontown. But yeah, this outfit, I feel like somebody's uh, security or something. I'm feeling good. I, I belong in like some, some fashion show. My sister said, <laughs> my, 
My sister said she got scared when she saw me with the glasses because she thought I was a killer. I'm okay with that. I'll put the thing in. <laughs> I killed it. we did this one personally as always i think we killed it like we always do i feel like this one i really enjoyed just because we had so many similar pieces yeah. it was just like at this point put in the puzzle piece put in the puzzle piece aziza has a really unique style she takes streetwear and sometimes she'll put a little skirt sometimes okay. she put a little dress a little sneaker like she'll wear like a dress but then she'll wear like the adidas sambas mm -hmm. or she'll wear a skirt and the adidas sambas like yeah, we gotta we gotta talk about the Samba someday. Like maybe we gotta like have a phone call or something. I don't know. Um, it was really exciting getting to recreate some of her, her um outfits on her Instagram. Mm -hmm. By the way, her um her reels, her TikTok videos, superb. That's right. One of the best content creators I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> um, you're great. But and honestly, please, my yeah. favorite outfit, personally, that I would say, was definitely the whole suit. Mm. You can never go, like, I feel like a suit, everyone needs a suit. Get a suit. Mm. It's just a staple, and I really enjoyed that one. Mine mm. might have to be the one with the parachute pants, but mm. it could change. I don't know, parachute pants and me, they go hand in hand. Please make sure to tag her in this, make sure she sees it, because we want her to see it. Aziza, come see this video, please. Um, and tell us what you thought. Um, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And ring that post notification bell. And we'll see you guys in the next one. And we'll see you guys in the next one. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Ah! Ring, ring, ring that post notification bell.